All right, in this video, we're gonna go over standing decompression. So with standing decompression, always start at your feet. Are your feet parallel to the outside walls? Do you have three points of contact? And if these terms are new to you, look for my videos that talk about three points of contact. So I'm standing tall with my three points of contact. My knees are slightly bent. I'm gonna take my measuring sticks, measure myself and get tall. I'm gonna make sure that my chin is stacked over my sternum. My ears are stacked over my shoulders and my shoulders are stacked over my hips. It's really important that we create this nice tall posture because what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be activating certain muscles with our breath that pull ourselves up out of our joints. So measuring sticks, our decompression breath is big expansive breath with an active exhale. So our big inhale, I get tall, my exhale is active, so my belly goes back on exhale. I'm, I'm tall the whole time. Think of it this way. Sternum lifts myself up. I stay tall, I've got space between my ribs now, and I exhale, belly goes back on exhale. Everything is stacked. Now let's throw in a hand position. So let's do sphere of tension, standing decompression. Here's my sphere, I'm gonna push. My shoulders are light and soft. My breath is forceful on the exhale. Big inhale. Big exhale. We're gonna do sphere of tension high of the forehead. Belly goes back on exhale. So watch my belly on this. Belly gets small on exhale. Here's my belly again. Belly on exhale. Play with the standing decompression if you're feeling compressed. If your posture is taking you here, if your shoulders are hurting, if your neck is hurting, transfer some of that load onto the posterior chain, transfer some of that load onto your SCMs, lift your body up with your breath, and stay tall with your exhale. Play with the standing decompression. Cheers.